Here's a problem from the Oxford University Math Submissions Test. How many solutions does this equation have? The integral from naught to x of sine of sine of t dt equals zero. And x here is between zero and two pi. In order to do this, we're gonna first sketch the graph of y equals sine of sine of t and between zero and two pi. Well, when t is zero, sine of sine of zero is zero, so it's gonna pass through the origin. It's also gonna pass through zero, uh, sorry, two pi is zero, and it's also gonna pass through at pi. Now, when t is a small positive number, sine of t will also be small and positive, and so sine of sine of t will be small and positive. So it's going to go up here, and in fact, it's not too difficult to convince yourself. It's going to have a maximum over here at sine of 1, and it's going to dip down like this through pi and actually look very similar to a sine curve. Okay, cool. So now what's the integral from 0 to x? Well, if x is somewhere over here, the integral from 0 to x is precisely this area there. And that's clearly not going to be zero. And in fact, we need x to be somewhere in this territory in order to kind of start cancelling out area. But by the symmetry of this curve, the only way that the, this area can be entirely cancelled out would be if x is right at the end at 2 pi. Hence, there's precisely one solution, namely x equals 2 pi.